Okay, a single turn of circular coil with a diameter of 3 cm is placed in the uniform magnetic field. The plane of the coil makes an angle 30 degree to the direction of magnetic field. If the magnetic flux through the area of the coil is 1.2 millivolt, calculate the magnitude of the magnetic field. Okay, so let's um, look one by one. So single turn, okay, here it says single turn, that means uh, n equal to 1. Okay, and then you have circular coil. A circular coil, that means a circle coil with a diameter, okay, 3 cm. Okay, that's a diameter. Uh, all right, and uniform magnetic field. And then you say plane, uh, this one important, the plane of the coil. The plane of the coil makes angle 30 degree to the magnetic field. Uh, so magnetic field, this is the B, yeah? So, uh, is this 30 degree the theta? Is this the, the question is, is this the theta straight away? Okay, is it? Uh, let us, uh, let us analyze this later, yeah? If the magnetic flux through the area of the coil is 1.2 millivolt, so this is the flux, uh, this is the flux uh, through the area, uh, so uh, flux, this is the phi, okay, this is the phi, so millivolt, you need to change to verbal, yeah, uh, okay, find the magnitude of the magnetic field, so I want the magnetic field, okay, so, uh, let us uh, look at this 30 degree. Is this the theta? Okay, uh, let us maybe draw out the diagram first. Draw the diagram. Let's say the magnetic field is this. Uh, let's say this is the magnetic field. Okay, and then I draw the coil. Uh, a coil, uh, okay, from this is a side view. Uh, I'm drawing a side view. Okay, uh, so this is the we can say this is the plane of the coil, yeah? The plane of the coil. This is the plane of coil. It makes um, 30 degree. 30 degree with the magnetic field. Uh, so I can say this one is 30. Uh, so this plane, it makes 30 degree with the magnetic field. So is this 30 degree? the sorry is this 30 degree the theta is this the the theta is this the theta no yeah it's wrong understand ah uh, so remember always uh, uh remember the notes theta is between the normal it must be the normal line with the magnetic field not the plane with magnetic field understand ah uh, so uh, this cos theta, theta is always the the normal. Yeah, vector A, is, the direction of the area is always the normal, normal to the plane. Okay, the no, the theta is angle angle between angle between direction of magnetic field and vector A. Ah, uh, yeah, direction of magnetic field and vector A. Vector A is the normal of the area, not the plane of the not the plane of the area. Understand? Ah, uh, so this is not theta. Yeah. Uh, first, you, uh, this 30 degree is between the plane and magnetic field, not between the normal. So, you must first draw the normal, eh? the vector A first. Where is the direction of vector A? Direction of vector A is this one. Uh, this is the direction of vector A. The normal line. Uh, the vector A is always the normal. So, the theta... Theta is uh, between the normal and magnetic field. Ah, so it's not it's not theta. Yeah? thirty degree is not theta. Yeah, theta is between normal normal with magnetic field, not the plane with magnetic field. Understand? So this is very catchy. Yeah, so uh, theta is uh, you should take um, ninety minus thirty, which is 60. Ah, you see? Because the normal line, the normal line is 90 degree to the plane. Normal line is 90 degree to the plane. So, 
So, 90 minus 30 is 60. Uh, so, theta is 60. Uh, so, theta is, uh, should be 60. 60, not 30. Understand? Not, not 30. It should be 60. Uh, okay? And then, he said this is a circular coil. I think you can find the area. Uh, I want to use the magnetic flux formula. Magnetic flux formula is uh, this one. Yeah? Flux is D dot A or B A cos theta. Uh, flux. Uh, N equal to 1. Eh? Only one turn. So, that's not M B A. Eh? It's just B A. Uh, no need to find magnetic flux linkage because only one turn. So it's uh and it's only BA, no MBA. Uh. Um uh magnetic flux is a dot product, yeah, dot product. That's why it's uh, BA cosine theta. If dot product use cosine, if cross product use sine theta. Understand? Okay, so I need to find the area. I need to find the area, it's a circular coil, so I can find the area. Okay. I R square. So uh, area is uh, I R square. Yeah, I radius square. Or you can take because uh, uh, radius radius is diameter over two. So um, you know, I diameter over two. So it become pi diameter square over two uh, over four over four. Yeah, pi diameter square over four. So I can use diameter also. Diameter is uh, 3 cm. I need to change to meter, which is uh, divided by 100 is 0 0.03. 0 0.03 meter. Okay, square divided by 4. So uh, I get what? What do I get? Uh, so let's calculate first this value. Okay, <coughs> excuse me. 0 0.03. A square multiply pi divide by 4 okay so I got the area is 7.0686 all right that's correct uh, exponent negative 4 meter square so uh, magnetic field magnetic field is oh I need ah okay the magnetic flux is 1.2 milli milli is exponent negative 3 all right milli milli is exponent negative 3 okay ma uh, magnetic field uh, area area is uh, seven point zero six eight six exponent negative four okay cosine sixty yeah uh, not thirty yeah uh, cosine sixty okay so I can find my magnetic field All right so what's the answer Okay, so the magnetic field is 3.395 Tesla. Okay, that's the answer. Okay, 3.395 Tesla. Okay, is that answer correct? Yeah, 3.4 or 3.395. Yeah, that's correct. Okay. So, uh, uh, remember, uh, flux is verbal. Flux is verbal. Magnetic field is flux is uh, verbal. Magnetic field is Tesla. I remember this one. Yeah, the unit. Okay, so that's all for these questions.